In this video, we're going to decompose a com composite function into its component functions. They give you h of x equals negative 5 over x, negative x minus 3 to the ninth power, and they want you to focus on that h of x is f of g of x. So they're saying that this function was composed using two different functions, and they want you to state what those two functions were. Well, there's going to be a few options here. The first option would be if I say g of x is equal to the denominator, I could write that as negative x minus, minus 3 to the ninth. I'm going to write that a little better. And then that would mean that f of x would have to be negative 5 over x. How this would work, I would write this as f of g of x if I were composing these two functions. And that would be f with an input of g, which would be negative x minus 3 to the ninth. I would plug that in for x here, and I would get our h of x function that we had originally. So one option would be for g of x and f of x to be these two functions. Another option would be if I say g of x is going to equal negative x minus 3. That would then mean f of x would have to equal, so basically replace negative x minus 3 with x here, and that would be negative 5 over x to the ninth. How that would look is f of g of x I go through and check this, I plug the g of x in, so I have f of negative x minus 3. I would then take the negative x minus 3 and plug it into the f function for x. That would be negative 5 over negative x minus 3 in parentheses to the ninth power. So I get again get the h of x function. So really my two options here are g of x equaling g of x equaling negative x minus 3 to the ninth and f of x equaling negative 5 over x and then also g of x equaling negative x minus 3 and f of x equaling negative 5 over x to the ninth. So those are the two options that I have for decomposing this h of x function. Basically, I'm trying to split that into two different functions that were composed to equal our h of x function, h of x function.